What's up guys, one among the fence here. Um, <clears throat> I just got home from school. And now I gotta go, oh crap. Now I gotta go take, or not, I don't have to go take, I have to go pick up Deborah like normal, like every single freaking day. Walmart shopper one. Shut up. Uh, so yeah, I gotta go do that. It's, I'm, I'm, I'm serious, it's, it's getting really old. Like seriously. Just picking up Deborah. I'm kind of sick of it. Cause I've been doing it for two years, well, pretty much a year and a half. I've been, well, I've been picking up Brian, Brian and Deborah since like beginning of last year. Okay, I was gonna say, I thought that was someone I knew. So getting the mail, look like Travis Wagner, or not Travis, but Andrew Wagner, the bass player in our band, in our marching band. Um, yeah, so. He's uh, Travis Wagner's brother, and Travis Wagner, so annoying, I swear. He's from California, and he moved here last year, and he plays the tuba in the marching band. He sucks butt at it, and just so annoying. And he's just knowing himself, so. His laugh is like, <laughs> That's his laugh, except it's a lot more annoying. Because <laughs> that, that was pretty freaking annoying, if you ask me. So, yeah. <clears throat> I actually brought my dad's debit card, too. I left it in my wall. Well, I didn't leave it in my wallet, but I... I had to go fill up the gas last night because it was literally on empty. It was, it, I was just going to run out. If I didn't fill it up last night, I would have ran out while I went to school. Like, while I was driving to school this morning, I would have ran out if I didn't fill up the gas last night. So, so yeah, that's why I had the debit card. I, I got gas, and then I forgot to put it back in... I forgot to give it back to Dad, to my dad. And I just... I left it on my dresser this morning. Well, last night, but then this morning, I took it. Well, I saw it on my dresser, and I was like, you know what? I totally forgot to give this back to dad, so I'll just keep it. And I'll just say, and you know, be like, oh, I forgot it in my wallet. You know, I, I left it in my wallet, you know, but I really took it and I got McDonald's for lunch. You know, I still have it, so I don't know if he noticed or not, but I hope he didn't because, well, he can't just assume that I bought something. I mean, the total is $4.97. It's five bucks, dude. Seriously, it's really not that big of a deal, so. So, yeah. But, yeah, he wouldn't suspect that, so. I'm going seven miles over the speed limit. I gotta freaking stop doing that, man. It is really hot in here. So, yeah, so I'm, I don't know. Should I go get the headphone adapter? I don't know if I should, because then Dad would see it. He'd be like, whoa, when did we get this? And I'd be like, oh, I just found it. He'd be like, yeah, right. He'd probably ask where it was. I'd be like, oh, just in the box downstairs in the garage, you know, where all the cords are. And there are, there's a headphone adapter in there, so I could, but that's a total big fat lie right there. I mean, I totally went to go buy it, you know, but I didn't even buy it yet. I don't know why I'm t making this up, you know. It's, I don't have to make it up because it's probably not going to happen, so I'm just going to give it, I'm just going to get the debit card back, you know, so. Anyway, oh my gosh. My life is just so screwed up right now. I, I know I'm, it's kind of, it's just, I don't know kind of that just you know it's kind of like an, that escalated quickly moment you know like I was just talking about something else all of a sudden I'm talking about my life like but seriously dude <laughs> okay so I know I've talked I know I put this in the in the, the <laughs> I know I put this in the description of my video uh, love makes you crazy a couple of vlogs back um, I know I, I put this in the description but you know how I you know how I was like so nervous to go to church and it was like more nervous than I, than I've ever been you know well, <clears throat> I was having I was having a little, another another one of my little episodes that I had back in September. You know, oh great, not one of these these lights. I swear, I never know when to go. Like seriously, I never know when to go ever. Like, when it starts flashing, I don't know when to go. I don't know if I should go now or I don't know, dude. Like, do I go? Because this this truck's not going, so I guess I don't have to go. But I don't know, dude. I guess I'll just wait till it stops flashing. I don't know, dude. This truck's not going either, so I'm just gonna do whatever this truck's doing, so. All right. I guess you're supposed to wait until it turns off. It says, stop on the flashing red lights, then proceed if clear. You know, it was clear, so I could've kept going, but that truck was stopped too, so I don't know. I'm really not sure. I need to look it up or something on, um, you know, the driver's ed manual, because I'm still not sure, man. Anyway, so yeah, I was having a little, remember, in my other in my other vlog like last month and I was talking about like how I had that weird dream that I had while I was driving you know except I was like fully awake the whole time so it was like 
a dream while I was awake, you know, I was talking about that. Well, I had one of those as I was vlogging that day on Sunday, like, what, three days ago? No, yeah, three days ago. And it's weird because it was the, it was a month, it was almost exactly a month after the first one happened. The first one happened on September 12th, and this one happened, and this other one just happened on October, on October 13th. So what, the next time it's going to be on November 14th this time? The day Gabe, the, the one year mark of Gabe's mission? Gabe leaving on a mission? I mean, I don't know. We'll see if it happens, it'll be pretty crazy if it does. Either that or just be somewhere around there, like November 12th or 13th or something, somewhere around there. That'd be so weird if that actually did happen though, dude. Like it happens every, like once a month, like kind of kind of like a period for a girl, you know? <laughs> Except for it's an episode for a guy, I don't know, whatever. But yeah, it's weird that that happened, you know? Because I was totally having an episode while I was vlogging, you know, I was like, and you know how I was like talking about like I was being all weird at one, at that one point? I was like, I don't, I'm just, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, you know how I said that? Because I, did, I didn't know what I was saying. I was being weird. I, I, I don't remember what the heck I was saying. I, it'll, be kind of it'll be kind of interesting to watch it happen, you know, when I watch the, when I watch the vlog back. Because I didn't watch it back. I, I never do. I never watch my vlogs after I record them. I never watch them back. Because I want it to be a surprise. Because I always forget what I said in my previous vlog. So it'll, it'll be kind of cool to see what I said and not remember. Be like, I don't remember saying that, you know. So it's as if as it, it's as if there's another person talking, you know. It's as if it's, it, it's, as, if, it's as if it's not me, you know, because I don't remember what I, I don't remember what I said in the past. Because my 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 first vlog was like two months ago. I don't remember what the crap I even talked about. I mean, I I know I talked about like my Eagle Scout. Don't, that's a, that's pretty much it. I remember talking about like finishing it. I don't remember exactly what I said though. It was like a freaking 12 minute vlog too. Like all my vlogs are like so long and. Well, they're not that long. I mean, they're only like 12 to 13 minutes, 10 minutes. And well, the average is like 10 minutes because some of them are like six minutes, some of them are 14 minutes, you know? So the average is like around 10, so yeah. Yeah. So I'm just waiting for Deborah. I'm here a little earlier. It's like 3.48, so I got like four minutes to go. So. Oh my gosh, okay, seriously, my new song, Run Away With Me, I wrote it like last year. Like, I wrote it while Gabe was still here. I wrote it like, I think it was like last, at the end of October, beginning of November last year. I don't even remember how I wrote it, I mean, I just kind of came up with it, you know, but I've been, I've been, it's been, it's almost a year old now, and it's seriously, it's definitely my new favorite song that I've written. You know, after, out of all my songs that I've ever written, Run Away With Me is definitely my favorite, dude. It is such a good song. I don't know, I, it, I don't know how else to say it. You know, it. It's just such a good song. Run away with me, we could escape and make it our destiny. You know, just, I don't know. That part doesn't, I don't know if that part makes sense or not, dude. I don't even know. It's like, we could escape and make it our destiny. Is that, does that make sense? Like, we can you make a destiny? Can you make something like your destiny? I don't know if it makes sense at all, dude. I really have no idea. We could escape and make it our destiny. I mean, the chorus is good. I like the chorus. And then also the breakdown, or not the breakdown, but the bridge. I'm not so sure that where we are is enough to get away and we won't get very far. Take a look in my eyes. Do you see your disguise? Maybe you're gonna have to trust me. Maybe in the meantime we can count the stars. Save a little time on top for hours and hours. If they ever I like that part. That part's the best part in the whole song right there. Maybe in the meantime we can count the stars, save a little time and talk for hours and hours. That part's awesome. I love that part. Like the way it sounds and everything and the lyrics the lyrics are cool, you know. Like maybe in me maybe in the meantime we can count the stars. Save a little time and talk for hours and hours, you know. I don't know, make it sounds cool, I like it. Whereas all my other songs are like, Thanks to all of the people down in Amberland, the cause of fire in the world is coming to- It's so stupid. Like, the lyrics for Into the Flames make no sense at all. Oh my gosh. Like, Charring and searing pain, our best hope is to pray for rain. Like, seriously, your best hope is to pray for rain? Rain's not gonna stop a fire from- Rain's not gonna put out a fire. Like, seriously, it's not gonna freaking work, man. I mean, the guitar and stuff sounds cool, but it's too repetitive, I think. Like my, like Into the Flames, it's too repetitive, I think, man. 
Like all the the whole song is literally that the same chords the whole time. You know, it's like it does that the whole freaking song, except for the chorus. Well, that's I don't I don't even know if there's a chorus in this song. I know there's verses and stuff. There's not really a chorus, but it just does. Except for the part where it's like that part's cool. I like that part too. <clears throat> well, I guess Deborah's. I don't know if Deborah's out yet, but uh, yeah, I got mutual tonight, and I got to meet with Brother Polson about my freaking eagle. I was gonna do that on Sunday. That's why I got my eagle pro my eagle application. But I didn't even go to church. I had to, I went home. I I didn't talk about. It. I actually went home. I I got to the church, and I was so nervous that I literally sat in my car, not even wanting to go in there because I was you know I was having a little episode, episode or whatever. And I literally didn't want to go in there because I was so freaking nervous. I was like, dude, I'm not going in there. I'm just going to go. I literally went home. I didn't even go in. So I brought my Eagle application for nothing. So I went to have to meet with Brother Paulson tonight at Mutual. So I have no idea if it's, if it's going to be before or after Mutual or during. I don't know. I don't even know what we're doing for Mutual, man. Anyway, I'm going to go now because Deborah. it's like well, 3 3.52. So Deborah should be out by now. So <sighs> see you guys tomorrow. Was I supposed to talk about something? I don't remember. Anyway, well, I was gonna read my note cards, but I'm not, I'm, I don't know why I want to do that. But I finally talked to my Aaron Todd. Jeez, that took a while for me to do. But anyway, well, I won't see you guys tomorrow. I'll see you whenever, I, whenever I vlog. Cause I didn't vlog yesterday at all. So I'll see you when I see you. Bye. I never. I, I need to find. I need to come up with an intro and an outro. Cause these are stupid. Hey, what's up, guys? One of them in the fence. Okay, bye.